Meanwhile, the Utes now 15 days away from the Holiday Bowl with Northwestern in San Diego. And Utah will be without at least two coaches for that game. Of course, Gary Anderson left to become the head coach of Utah State. Then on Thursday, Whittingham announced that linebacker coach Justin Enna would go with Anderson to Logan, become the Aggies defensive coordinator. Now listen to Whittingham's interview on Thursday, especially those last few words. Great opportunity for Justin. It's a chance for him to run his own defense. And, and uh, you know, most all assistant coaches aspire to be coordinators. Coordinators aspire to be head coaches. And that's just, that's just how it is. And when you have success, and, uh, you know, that, those things seem to happen more prevalently. And, you know, last year we lost nobody. Uh, this year, you know, it looks like, uh, you know, we've already lost a couple and, and uh, maybe more. Who knows? And maybe more. What did he mean by that? When we heard that on Thursday, we thought that Kyle knew something was in the works with another one of his coaches. How about offensive coordinator Troy Taylor? Is that the guy he's talking about? Reports from the Sacramento Bee is that Taylor is one of three finalists to become the head coach at Sacramento State. Taylor is from Sacramento, but if he did leave Utah for the Sacto job, he would have to take about a three to $400,000 pay cut. An announcement could come as early as tomorrow.